Okay, now th this is one where I didn't see what happened and you didn't see what happened and because you weren't there. Yeah, I just heard it so many times. Uh, I, for years, uh, I'd always ask Kevin and Kenny to come down together, which uh -huh. is my, you know, my son-in-law's, of course. My brother-in-law's. Yes. Yeah. And so we would uh, go down there and uh, they finally went one year and they were in the boat to get in a boat together. And uh, we were all fishing there from the dam back down the river. That's when we was up towards the dam. Mm -hmm. We'd go down and then come back and then go down and come back. And the fishing just wasn't really great that year. And uh, so um, they had been, they went on down the river because we wasn't catching them right up by the dam like we were doing and stuff like that. But a few of us were and, and some, you know, that's when Ron Austin was coming and uh, a bunch of other guys that, that from up here, there was more from Kansas City than there was from Oklahoma down there at mm -hmm. that time. And uh, so we ended up, uh, they went on down, Kevin and Kenny went down the river and they, uh, we didn't see them for a long time. And finally they come back up about the time we was all ready to get out and everything else. And so we all went over there and, and we caught a few in our boat, uh, Padley and myself and, uh, and Ron had caught some and, and, uh, we, we had a real nice one. Uh, the worst thing that happened on there was that Padley caught probably the biggest crappie we ever caught in our life down there. And I'll bet it was about, 15 inches long mm -hmm. and he had it over the side of the boat and he was going to put his thumb in his mouth and it fell right out the hook came right out and a big old crappie just dropped right down in the water and took off <laughs> and i never let him live that down <laughs> and he, he uh but when kenny and uh and kevin come in and there's they we it was all everybody said how many fish you got and they said we didn't we didn't catch any Kevin said, though, but I caught a bird. <laughs> and I think that he, what he'd done is he'd throw his hook out there or something like that, and there was one of those water birds. That yeah, I think it was one of the, if I remember the story right, it was one of the bigger, like herons or cranes or yeah, something was, like that. Yeah, some kind of crane. I don't know if it was a blue heron, they call yeah. them. Yeah. Uh -huh. uh, and they only spell it with one R instead right. of two. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, he... Uh, um, he said that thing hooked the wing and then they had to get that thing off of there and then they put net on it or something because it was huh. biting like, you know, it was yeah, and things. everything else. And um, that, you know, made it interesting. <laughs> and then Kenny said, well, I, I caught this here and he pulled up and there was a brake clutch off of a car and <laughs> he hooked onto it thought he had a great big old fish and he had fought that thing got all the way in it was a brake clutch oh wow and so <laughs> yeah, that's hilarious that was uh, that was his big catch of the day i mean we used to talk about catching rock bass which was just a joke <laughs> yeah. and then we used to talk we'd catch you know log bass yeah we, you know we we caught just about every kind of thing you could imagine but i've never caught a bird no and i've no. never caught a brake clutch that, uh, they got me that, beat on both of those counts. Yeah, that, that got yeah that that was uh, <laughs> that was everybody got got tickled at that one. Yeah, I mean that they you know they just couldn't believe it. And he had it. He kept it. He had it in the boat would show everybody what he caught. <laughs> That's crazy. But uh, that uh, was just that was just the one. That was the only time they ever went. Yeah. They never did go again. <laughs> no wonder. <laughs> <laughs> only caught a bird in a in a clutch.